Alright, hello everyone and welcome today to my next playthrough, which will be The Prince of Persia, The Forgotten Sands, which actually I believe this game came out just about two years ago, but I never did get it and eventually I just said, oh, I'll get it when it gets cheap. And I checked it before I left in August, at the start of August, and it was still 14, I mean 18, and when I came back it was 8 and I'm like, I gotta get this, so thank God for GameStop's uh, amazing deals. Because otherwise I would not have gotten this game at all. Actually, the, it's pretty funny because the other Prince of Persia is um, only about the same price as this now. But I wasn't interested in that Prince of Persia. I heard it wasn't that great. So, in any event. This is actually uh, very reminiscent of some of my earlier playthroughs when I tried to do a Sands of Time playthrough. Tag fighting. And actually, this is going to be good, because it's going to give me Ubisoft points, because of Ubisoft's Uplay. Because Prince of Persia is published by Ubisoft, so that's good. So first off, I want to go to the options, because there are no subtitles, and of course, you can always have them in 500 different languages, because Ubisoft is based in uh, Europe, I believe. What the shit? Okay, I guess I enabled it. Alright, good. Subtitles in English. Yes, please. Alright, let's begin. Select your level of difficulty. I would like to pick cancel as my level of difficulty. But alright, they only have normal and easy. I would like to start the game on cancel. Alright. White screen. Ooh, water. A delicious, refreshing spring. In the middle of nowhere. Quite literally. It's almost like I've been here before. The sands of time, perhaps. Ugh! Bitch, can I get a drink of water? Who are you? What have you done? You ask as if I were a ruffian, a wanderer with no place in this palace. Know that I am a son to King Sharama. And brother Prince Malik. Prince Malik, who rules here in our father's name. I did not come here seeking a mythical army. I was sent to study alongside my brother, that someday I might be as great a leader as he is. This territory was once the heart of King Solomon's mighty empire. According to legend, it holds a secret we are sworn to protect. His massive harem! That secret is the reason the fortress is much sought after by neighboring kingdoms. Malik was sent here so the army would have a strong commander. Discourage I was sent alone, so I might be assassinated in route. Well, all the discouraging that did. Oh, oh, oh. Okay. I guess riding down into the palace wasn't an option, or you know, even riding around the fight. Let's jump from rock to rock. Fire the sneak shots! Fire the flaming meatballs! Like usual, the Prince of Persia. Couldn't just walk in. Why not walk? It's my blood. Well, this is not the Use R to change the camera angle. Ooh. Alright, good, I can move. The ramparts. 
Press A to jump. And ha! X to attack. Fuck you, fuck you! Mm. Let me guess, A is also to dodge. Slap the shit out of him with this sword. Okay, break that. Fuck the supplies. Nothing in there. Probably up here. Oh, run towards the wall and hold RT to run up. I have to find Malik. He'll be planning a way out of this. Actually, wait, hold on. How do I drop B? Good thing I didn't run out. Oh, there's nothing there. Run along the wall and hold RT. Press Y to knock your enemies down. <laughs> Fuck you! <laughs> Immediately punch him on the floor. What the hell? They just disappear. Yet another game where normal humans suddenly vanish into nothingness. Remember to hold RT while running on the wall. Okay. I was. Up we go. I guess I still have to hold it no matter what. Press B to drop. Perhaps climbing up here wasn't the best hmm, idea. I wonder, was it? Hold RT to reach a higher ledge. There you go. Simple platforming, especially after Dark Siders. Oh shit! <laughs> they almost stuck me with a bunch of toothpicks. Hmm, it's almost as though a war is going on right here, but I just can't put my finger on it. Oh, uh, uh. I'm starting to feel that the odds in this battle are not in our favor. Bunch of generic grunts looking around. Press B to dodge. Oh, but you can still get hit while dodging. Ooh, some more amazingly well-crafted bosses, which today would no doubt belong in a museum. It's, it's just slits, sunlight coming in. Looks like the only way out is to climb up. There's A to jump away. Shooting arrows at me in here. Not yet, anyway. All right, and complete it. Hold RT to climb up. Fairly simple enough. Oh. Well, I was only about to wall run that. Asshole. Looks like I'm gonna wall run it anyway. Oh shit! You missed me! Where'd those arrows even come from? This room's enclosed. Oh no, I can see from right there in that little opening. Alright, and grab the banner. And now cut it in two. Fuck the flag of the royal family. Oh shit! Oh shit! I thought there was something hidden down there. Yes! On the wall run, press A to jump away from the wall. Got it. What is this? Just jump to that. Beautiful silk. Ruined. This reminds me press of a A to jump and then 
attack with X to perform an aerial slash. This also Memories of Azad. Azad. Wasn't that the place from uh, the first game? <laughs> Memories of Azad. Just play the game. Oh, apparently that guy died and I didn't even touch him. Alright, so I probably have to make a break for it. This is looking worse and worse. Hmm. I wonder. Oh shit! Ah! Oh, maybe I'm not supposed to wall run that. Am I? Oh yeah, I am. How do I climb this? I'm holding RT. There we go. You have to get a little bit of speed first, a speed boost. Whoops. How do you commence a wall run from this? No shit, I pressed the wrong button, it was RT. Damn it, son of a bitch. <laughs> Damn it, this is just like the Sands of Time. Now hop to that. Cause it's, it's weird, because the camera angle is sort of in between forward and no uh, forward and right. It's very awkward. Yes, because this is standard fare of the royal family. Every time you want to enter a room, you're going to have to wall run. Back to the gate! Follow the prince! Why not? Why actually use, you know, locks and keys when you can wall run and put yourself in danger? Make way for the prince! Malik! Nope, he couldn't hear him. The fortress. He must not hear me with the battle going on. More toothpicks for decoration? That's what these guys are. They're just the local delicatessen. <laughs> oh, when an enemy's on the ground, it's next to finish him. Well, usually when they get on the ground, they're already dead. So here, do this. Jump! Jump again! Hold X to do a power attack. Wow! It's, it instantly killed them. <laughs> instantly killed them. Alright, that door's busted. Why didn't they tell me that before? It looks like I can grab on here. That's way better than the wimpy slash attack. Alright. Another switch on the wall. Oh, no, 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 no. Do a wall run. If you love not walking so much, why don't you just, you know, not walk there? Do some nice parkour. And they're gonna seal another gate. Good. I was only trying to follow them. Here we go, we're gonna go up and around. And back down. Can I just drop and save myself some time? Here, once it evens out. Yep. No, you drop from bricks to go to more bricks. Press B to roll under. Hold X to do a power attack. Oh shit, I was facing the wrong way. Ha! Bitch slap! 
Oh shit, there was